All right, yo, we have a whole. Oh my god, yo, yo, look at this, look at this insanity, man. All right, what is up, everyone? Welcome back to part three of Near Automata. Last time we left off with Jackass over here exploding the gate and saying we got to take out some enemies in the desert, so that's exactly what we're about to do. <laughs> <laughs> who opens a gate with explosives well let me tell you man we live in the post apocalyptic machine world world all right you gotta do what you gotta do like take out these robots with uh lasers man of course yeah these guys are um level six still so they're, they're they're all right you know they're not too uh too hard but you guys notice they're wearing masks yeah these machines in the desert look very different from machines uh that are in the city so you know what's up with them man i thought all machines were the same All right, yeah, man, this is desert. It looks, this looks amazing, man. This looks beautiful. I love this little sliding mechanic that they added to save you, uh, save you time. All right, but you guys can see in the mini map, there's these little uh, red, <laughs> like the red diamonds. Careful, we got some enemies approaching. It's all right, man. It's our entire goal here. On droids, yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys better just calm down, man. Yeah, so when the machine started talking, that's uh, it's quite an interesting one right there. You know, kind of plays on the whole, like, who are the enemies, you know? Like, kind of Attack on Titan-ish, which is why I call this the mechanical Attack on Titan. Let's make our way over to the next red spot right here. And I just love the calming music in the background, you know? Just, just makes you really take in the scenery. Oh, what the heck? Oh, this guy is leading an army over here. <laughs> Yo, do they understand the concept of being scared? That's a tough one. Oh, this man is a level 10. Yo, this man is a... Yo, this man is a gang leader over here. You gotta take him out ASAP. Nice. And by the way, um... Didn't mention that before, but for 9S, I put him in uh, aggressive. Yeah, I like him to just go, <laughs> just go ballistics on the on the enemies over here. All right, let's keep making our way over here. Yeah, sometimes if we do, um, if we do have to run for quite a while, I'll just like cut it out. But over here is another save point, so yeah, or access point, whichever one you want to call it. Let my man 9S take care of that. All right, great. And you're over here, map information unlocked. So um, the reason why you want to do this, why do this, yeah. <laughs> um, why you want to unlock those is because later in the game, if you just want to um, fast travel, uh, those are your those are your options, man. So whenever you discover one of those, it's uh, very helpful. Plus, you get to read your mail. So yeah. Who doesn't want to read their mail in a fictional game? Oh, hold on, hold on. Yo, yo, yo. This is... A whole bunch of them came out. Get him, Tubi! I seen that sort of thing when I was going through some old data. Oh my, yo! This man got a great hit off me. Beautiful, man, beautiful. <laughs> that one guy, the lone soldier. Alright, let's keep taking out the enemies. Where to next? Just gotta keep going straight. Alright, yo, we have a whole. Oh my god! Yo, yo, look at this. Look at this insanity, man. Suicide robots. Yo, these guys were just meant to explode. If you guys ever played, um,. Gears of War, those, uh, those tickers, I think that's what they call it. The tickers that just have bombs strapped on them. Yeah. <laughs> They have suicidal robots on here. Should put a good question on your mind. Alright, our next group of enemies is right here. Let's take them out, man. We got the laser. Scared. 
the heck? Yeah, exactly. These guys are screaming out, you know, help me. You know, they're scared. But they're machines, you know, what the hell do machines know? Oh, last one right there, my man. A oh, man, I nice took care of it. No problem. <laughs> Situations like those. Exactly, I wanted Nine to be aggressive, you know, help me out. If you put him in, like, uh, cautious, he'll usually just kind of, like, stay back, you know, let you do the fighting, and then when you're about to be attacked, he'll be like, no, no, like, 2B, and then he'll just come right at you. All right, nice, we're here. Look at that. A sand waterfall. Doesn't that just look great? Oh, a lone soldier taking us on? You're crazy, my good son. Wait. What? What just... It's running away? Wow, he really just... Really just ran away and he was screaming like, help me. A lost city in the desert? Yeah, look at that, man. <laughs> I love doing that. Mail notification received. Yo, let's go. Oh, this is one of my favorite songs from the whole entire soundtrack. I just love, I just love the vocals. I love the woman they chose for this. Another access point right there. Let's take care of it. <laughs> yes. Yo, you know what? <laughs> just, just look at the go off. Look at this guy. He don't even need me. Yeah, just, just go for it, buddy. Hey. <laughs> Yo, this man literally did all the work for us. Nice. Alright, let's keep making our way over toward uh, the red area right there. We gotta chase that guy down. That certainly was a weird situation though. You know, think about it. He was just, uh, wasn't even fighting back. He was actually screaming for help and then he just ran away. Oh, there he is again. Yo. <laughs> This man just popped out of the ground. Let's get him! Oh! <laughs> Yo, did the robot just say, Nice weather today and how are you? What's... What does this game come to? Alright, yo, this place, this place is looking pretty, uh, pretty nice for an abandoned area that humans were driven out of. Oh, uh, you know what? You got that, 9S. You got that. I'll take care Oh my god! <laughs> so much enemies. Man, look at that. They're hopping around, too. The hell? They're screaming. Yo, they're screaming for pain. Oh, my son, Ninas, weave that, yo. You put it in the work, I see you. Last guy right here. Huh? Mm -hmm. Stab him, Nine. Oh. Just want to go for the stab. Nice. Now we can make our way over here calmly. Never mind, never mind. You will break. Yo, who do you think you're talking to, yo? We're the main, the main protagonist. Alright, yeah, so this guy is bulletproof, so the only way to put in the work is to go right at him. 
I don't think I don't even think the laser works on this guy. Yeah, it does not. So let's heal up real quick. Let's get just one quick swing in. Oh, keep dodging. <laughs> keep dodging. Get away. And we got him. There we go. There we go. And we leveled up. Look at that. That was a, a guy up there controlling him. All right, let's make our way over here. You know, I always try to make my way up these uh, these fire escapes. <laughs> He's like, not this way. I wonder what makes him choose those words. Exactly. Oh, we got a tech manual. Alright, that should be interesting. Whoa. Killed by the local machine life forms. Yeah, it's very, uh, very odd. Oh, by the way, um... I haven't really shown it off yet, but... I haven't shown it off yet. But this game does have a network feature where... If you do connect to the network, aka just like online... Um, you get to see other players' bodies. So when they die, um, they appear on your screen too and you can pick them up. And you could take their XP, or you could repair them and they could use them to fight. So, yeah, I think I accidentally clicked to not connect to the network. So, yeah. Oh, it's all right. We can just Mary Poppins our way down. What is this? What? Is my son having... <laughs> my son is having the time of his life. Oh, he showed up. Let's get to it. Alright, uh, if you uh, if this is your first time playing this this one right here, you gotta be very careful. This can get very overwhelming super quick, trust me. So look, now there's a mix. Regular and regular machines and then just Oh! Yo, get away! Yeah. Using that laser is super risky right now. Get them all up there! Get out of here! Oh my god! Such a crazy amount of them.
Yeah, that's exactly what you think. The machines just gave birth to a brand new machine life form. And before we continue any further, I want to show you guys how extremely useful it is to repair the bodies that you see lying around. So like I said earlier, um, if you do connect online to the online features of this game, you are able to recover and repair these old bodies of the people who died. And right here, I decided to just, um, you know, I decided to just die on purpose so I could show you guys when you repair your body, you know, how helpful it is for this fight. You really want to do this, man, unless you're, uh, you know, unless you're that bold, you know, you think you're take on by yourself. Oh, he's learning. My guy is evolving. Yeah, we better finish it quick. Look at that. Look at our ally. <laughs> She's putting in the work. Perfect. I love that. Stab him to me. Ah, oh, man. He got that beautiful damage off of me. Let's heal up real quick. Fight me, you coward! Oh man, this guy's not playing games. Hit him with the laser. Yeah, we got great damage right there. Beautiful. Yeah, let's trade blows, man. Face me, coward! Let's get onto it. Mm, hit this man with the laser. Now where'd he go? Man, I genuinely have no idea where this man went. Oh. Oh, my son's using Kamui. Dodge it. Ah, oh, man. He's getting this crazy hits. Hit him with the laser. I'm not gonna lie, it looks like he took out our ally. <laughs> Yo, it's just me and 9S now! Ooh! Get out of there! All right, we gotta get out of here. Oh, we can make it. Yo, this whole place is collapsing. Come on. Almost there. Oh, no, this thing is gonna blow. Alright, I think we're good. Nice. What the hell just happened? I think we're all asking ourselves that. <laughs> yeah, I remember the first time I ever played this game. I was just, uh, I was just so shook at the fact that that just happened. Let's get this item real quick. 
yeah, sometimes it just gives you some great items over here, man. I've once picked up, <laughs> I've once picked it up and they gave me like 500G. I was like, whoa, whoa, that's a whole plug and shit. Yo, she really is Mikasa. Look at that. She put it into work. Come on, Nine. Let's be a gentleman. Oh! They just they just love giving us enemies off the rip, right? Mm. Yeah, I hope you hope it teaches this guy a lesson right here. You just saw your friend get massacred, yo. <laughs> Love it, man. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's get make our uh let's make our way back to base. I think that's enough sand for one day, you know? Operator <laughs> Imagine fighting the machine war for years and years, you know, hundreds of years actually, and then reporting to your commander a whole new species of machines were just found. Like, yeah, this is gonna take a great. Great turn to the war. And we're back to the city ruins, the lifeless city as I like to call it. Oh, of course. Okay. And resupply and conduct maintenance. You know what? No one nine s after uh after playing that for a good while. I think it's uh I think it's a good idea to return to resistance camp, you know? You got it. Let's get to it, man. <laughs> Plus that was our goal anyway, you know. Alright, we made our way back to the resistance camp, so we're gonna see what they want to say about this situation here. I think we just ended off right there, man. <laughs> this was a hectic video. Subquests. You can accept subquests from clients. Yeah, yeah, that's all right. Yeah, I'll probably just do this in the um, in my spare time when I'm just training up, gathering more money, and just gathering more plug-in ships. All right. Hey, what's up? Ah, uh, it's you. I heard from Jackass about your encounter in the desert. Good work.